Here we have a 69 plate Mercedes Benz A200 AMG line premium. Now, this vehicle comes with the 18 inch black alloy wheels, all in excellent condition and unmarked. We also have the Iridium silver exterior paintwork. We have the LED headlights, the Panamoca front grille with the black Mercedes badge in the centre. There's a look at the front end. We have the glass black front splitter with the canards as well. Round to the passenger side, you find we have the second alloy wheel, again unmarked. If you take a step back, you'll find we have colour-coded door handles and door mirrors, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass for the rear passengers. If you take a closer look at the third alloy wheel, just here. And then we also have the A35 style rear spoiler, sitting nice and aggressive. We have front and rear parking sensors with a reversing camera. The A45 style rear diffuser with the quad tip exhaust. If we take a look at the boot, so opening it up just like so, you'll find that we have a decent amount of space inside of here. We have the partial shelf as well. We also have a handle just here if you pull the boot back down, close that back up and walk back round to the driver's side. You'll find that this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. So if you take a look at the final alloy wheel, just there, as you can see again, once more in excellent condition. And then taking a look at the interior, so inside of here you'll find we have the half leather interior, the red stitching, we have the Alcantara, the foldable armrests and the fixed ISO points, vents down there for the rear passengers, we have the brush metal door handles, the Alcantara trim, red stitching and electric windows. If we take a look at the front again, we've got the half leather interior with the red stitching, both the front seats are heated and there is a look at them. We have the heated seat buttons just there on the doors, electric mirrors and electric windows for child lock for the rear. We have the integrated speakers, the auto lights and the electric handbrake. We also have a flat bottomed multifunctional steering wheel with paddle shifters either side. Taking the seat inside, you'll find again we have the red stitching just there on the steering wheel. We also have the speed limiter and the cruise control. Digital dashboard up top. If you put our foot on the brake, press the start button, then the vehicle will start up for us. So as you can see, we're free from any warning lights on the dashboard, other than about the fuel, so nothing to worry about. So we can change the view of the dashboard using this side of the steering wheel. If you press onto home, you can see we have all these options just here. We can have the navigation where you can have a full screen or a half screen like so. You can also change the radio, the media and plenty of other options as well. You can change the look of it so we can have a more classic style for the gauges as you can see just there. We also have the main infotainment screen in the centre. If any of these screens are flickering, that's just the camera. It's not flickering in real life, so nothing to worry about. So on here, you find the likes of the sat-nav. We also have the radio once more, where you find the FM, DAB and AM radios. We have the media as well, where you find that we have the Bluetooth, the USB and online music. The phone connectivity, just there. If you go to the main menu, you find we have all these options just here, which we've just been through. Scroll across, you find we have the comfort, where you find the ambient lighting, with plenty of colours to choose from. You may be able to just, be able, just about make out we have the ambient lighting running throughout this vehicle, also inside of the vents as well. If you go back onto the main menu, scroll across, you have, we, you have the apps just there for the browser. We have the settings, where you find all the assistance which makes it a very safe vehicle to drive putting the car into reverse you find we have the reversing camera we also have the front and rear parking sensors we have a few options which we can flick through it just like so put it back into parkler we also have the different drive modes so we have eco we have comfort sport and individual Further down, you find we have the climate control. We have the ice cold air conditioning just there, working as it should do. Inside of here, you find some storage space. We have two cup holders, 12 volt connectivity, and also a Type C USB port that can be closed off just like so. We have the touchpad for the infotainment screen, along with all the shortcuts as well. We have the leather armrest, which can be opened up for more storage. But that's all that I'm going to show you guys today. If you'd like to find out more, then please check out the website. This vehicle comes with a fresh service, fresh MOT, HBI clear, competitive finance deals, and free nationwide next day delivery. Thank you for watching.